Hello, curls. It's Yolanda Renee. I feel so gangster right now, you guys. I feel gangster because of this hat. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I got this hat as a Valentine's Day gift, you guys. It was a Valentine's Day gift from Wale's new brand, which is Working Title. So it's a line of beanies because you guys know Wale's always rocking a beanie. And that, you know, as a hip-hop artist, at least I know, well, just in general, as a hip-hop artist or whatever type of business you're running, if you want to be a boss, you can't just do one thing. Um, like, for example, me, I have my brands. I do YouTube. I have my t-shirt line. I have coloring books. I have all these different things that I do to create revenue for myself, my family, and to just put out into the world um, to help my girlfriends with their hair, with their fashion, whatever. Um, so, yeah, to be a boss, to really live the life you want to live, you need to hustle not hustle in a bad way to like get over on people because some people do tend to think that's what hustling means because they think of like drugs and stuff but no hustle in a good way hustle to make your money to make your brand to service your people and you have to be a hustler and um you know it does go for everybody in this world if you want to do what you love to do you have to be able to do it in different ways. I decided to go in this direction because, you know, Devin is a hip-hop artist and he does music. And that's what he likes to focus on is the music. And, you know, over the years, I've been trying to teach him or to show him that you can't just do music. Like, if you think of, like, Jay-Z and, again, back to Wale, they do music, but you they can't just solely think about that. They have endorsements, but those endorsements can go away. So you should always hustle. So I'm so proud of Wale for starting this work and title brand with his signature beanies because that's something for him to do if the music stops, you know? It's something for him if an endorsement deal goes out the window. He still has this backup of his beanie line. So bravo to Wale. Um, this is basically a um, pep talk and at the same time it's part of my shop black series where I'm highlighting businesses that are black owned that you can support and of course Wale is making the big money with his music um, and you know he probably has enough money so why support him but I really believe that you guys can support him in his new venture which is this um, beanie line because the music may not always help him um, and he needs something that he can fall back on and I'm pretty sure I don't know 100% about this brand but I'm pretty sure he has his family working um, the brand so he's also helping people stay employed I'm pretty sure like I just have a feeling that his family is helping him run this or his closest friends and he's from the DMV you guys yay DMV but yeah, so his brand is called Working Title, and here is the little tags that were on here. Working Title, they're really nice. This was on the beanie, I should have left it on there. <laughs> um, but yeah, and then the packaging, it's his logo, Working Title. His packaging is just his logo, and you know, it was a nice little packaging for the beanie. So, what I like about this beanie is okay, so his logo is on here. This is another, it's like a metal well, not metallic, it's metal, it's some type of metal, and it has his logo on there, which that's pretty awesome. That's really nice quality for a tag. Um, and then Honestly, you guys, this feels handmade. It looks handmade in a good way. Um, I like the different prints he has here. It's blue and then it's gray. And then we have this purple and black checker. And then a pop of like an accent color, which is like this turquoise little ball up here, which I love that detail. You guys know I've been rocking beanies lately before while they sent me this. But, um... The other one I've been wearing has the little fur ball on there. So I really like that detail. Um, this beanie is humongous. I have like 
tons of hair underneath of this hat and I also it's also a wig and I also have my hair underneath of here which is twisted so as you can see lots of like stuff under this hat but it still fits on there my head looks huge <laughs> but I'm just trying to show you that this hat will fit over top of everything whether you're wearing poetic justice braids a wig even if I had my fro out it would fit on top of there really nicely um, so yeah, I really love this hat. I think that his, I think that his website is currently under construction. It's workingtitle.com. I'll put the, how you spell it right here because it's kind of like a abbreviation for it. So it's spelled like that. So it's like an abbreviation for working title. So that's the website, workingtitle.com definitely support Wale and his brand. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this mini series showcasing Wale's ma amazing hats. They're so cute. I love them. I love it. I love it, you guys. And he has all different color combinations. He even has like the um bucket hats. He has the brim hats like a snapback or whatever. So it's all different kinds. You can go check it out and also follow him on Instagram. It's at working title um as well. But yeah, I think that's all I wanted to tell you. Also, if you want to see how I did these wine curls, I'm doing a tutorial today as well. So make sure you check that out. But anyway, you guys, thanks for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye, girls.